now. Your latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. I'm Kate Lucanute. Here's a look at your headlines this Thursday, February 18th. Overland Park police say a child is in the hospital following a crash. It happened at Flint Road and West 164th place as that fifth grader was leaving Timber Creek Elementary on an electric scooter. Police say the child turned in front of a car and that's when they were struck. Police confirm the child is breathing, conscious and talking. We will let you know if anything changes as far as that child's condition. The vaccine clinic in Clay County has been postponed for tomorrow and Saturday. That's due to a delay in vaccine shipments caused by winter weather nationwide. The Eastern Kansas VA system says delays are impacting them as well, and that could delay or reschedule appointments. The VA is assuring patients it will work with those who are being impacted. An icon in the Kansas City barbecue scene has died. Elsie Richardson passed away yesterday. You might recognize that name as the owner of Elsie's Barbecue. The restaurant is on Blue Parkway in Kansas City, Missouri. An employee told 41 Action News about Richardson's passing, although they did not say how he died. Richardson was 86 years old. A positive update now on the power grid. The Southwest Power Pool ended its energy emergency alert. The SPP directed energy providers, including those here in our area, to shut off power to some customers earlier this week. You'll recall those were supposed to last 30 to 90 minutes, but for some people, the power stayed off between three and six hours. The good news is, again, they're not anticipating any more of those forced outages. Well, speaking of the weather, let's talk about a warm up, Gary. Um, tomorrow, 34, above freezing for the first time in a long time. And then look at next week. 54 Monday, 62 Tuesday. So at least for two days, we have a huge warm-up. Remember to get your news and weather anytime at KSHB.com.